Welcome to this video guys, I have this project here. Let's see how we can upload or push this project to GitHub. First, go to github.com and let's create a new repository where we will push it. So what we need to do is we need to initialize a local Git repository and then you push that Git repository to GitHub. So I'll name this test by repo. Okay, and if this is available, just click on create a new repository. So this is like the store where we push our code, right? But what we first need to do is we need to initialize our local Git repository. So what you can do is come back to your project and click on terminal, click on new terminal. Now here we need to run a few commands. Run, run git init and you'll see this message initialized empty git repository. Now if you're seeing an error that says git not found or something like that, you need to in install git on your system. To install git on your system, go to this URL. I'll have this in the description below and then click on any of your OS what you are using. So if you're on Windows, click on Windows. If you're on Mac, click on Mac and then installer will be downloaded and then just download Git, okay? If you want to see the whole process, I'll have the link in the description below. Now, once you've installed Git, go back to your project and then run Git init and this time it should work. After Git init, we need to commit so that we can push our code. So commit means that our change is ready to be pushed. So after that, we commit. Okay, one more thing before committing, we need to tell Git how many files or how many uh, what folders, what files we need to track and we need to push. So doing Git add and then this period sign or full stop and then hit enter. Now this full stop will add all these files to tracking. So this means that all these, all both of these two files will be pushed. And now just write Git commit and then write a message. Let's say initial commit. Okay, so now we have initialized our local Git repository and locally everything is good to go. But we need to push it to a Git URL that is our GitHub URL, right? So go back to your GitHub, copy this URL and then write this command git remote add origin and then paste the URL. Your The URL is in this format, your username and then your repository name and then add dot git. Hit enter. And now if you want to check if this remote URL has been successfully added or not, just write this command, git remote-v. And as you can see, you will see these URLs now in push and fetch. This means that when you push, it will, go, it will go to this URL. And when you pull, it will come from this URL. So now finally, we can clear and then write this command, git push origin and then the branch name. So initially we'll push to March master branch. And then just hit enter and now this will be pushed to our repository so as you can see it says this has been pushed from master branch to master branch now go to your git repository reload and here you will see your code so this is how you can push your local project or upload your local project to github if you have any questions let me know in the comments below